Moving day in Missoula at the 2023 Zoo Town Open presented by Inc. Realty Group and driven by Innova. We are at the spectacular Blue Mountain Disc Golf Course just outside of Missoula, Montana. And a highlight before we even let you know who we are in the booth, Marty Grant, hole number six, 324 feet. To A B. Good little pinball action there. Have a drop in for Birdie. Kevin Jones throwing now. Oh, yeah. Snuck a little bit through the right side, but just a beautiful line from Evan. That's just about perfect. You saw James take an extra moment, one more breath. Wow. That's a display of professionalism right there. Beautiful. Evan Scott with his second. Ooh, look at this shape, Grant. That's East Coast golf right there. To Barella at the sixth. We saw it aced earlier today. Unreal. <laughs> well, let's jump ahead to Anthony Barella. The entire chase card has fallen to, at best, a tie for 10th. I wonder if the afternoon will follow the morning pattern where some of the biggest movers were ones that had figured out that back nine and shot quite well. Barella for birdie. Wow. So smooth. Also love with that step putt, he anchors that lead foot. There's no doubt that it's a legal stepper. Ahead again to the eighth, Gannon Burr. That's a birdie to pull Gannon back to even for the day. Ahead now to AB. Throwing off the top of the world here at the ninth. Okay. Well, that's one way to do it, Grant. <laughs> Meanwhile, Conrad at the sixth. Oh, wow. Woo! Beautiful. Now to Kevin Jones. Oh, yeah. Big Stallheiser through the middle. Mm hmm. Evan Hot Scott up in the air. Dallin Blanchard. And the locals getting a show out here on their home course. You can hear the spectators in the background just stoked to see the players running the basket here on eight. Conrad first to throw.
Uh, sure. Yeah. I think he'll take that, Grant. Very nicely done. Using a very slow disc that was never more than three or so feet off the ground. Perfectly judged. Back to Burr now up the hill. Oh, there we go. That one stuck. Almost looked like a basketball shot from half court. Evan Scott spikes that one into the dirt, no more than five feet from the base of the pin. Mm hmm. Out in front, all by himself. Back to Gannon Burr now. He's ahead at the 13th. Look how steep this angle is he's throwing. That's way out there. Gannon needed all two million acres of the Lolo National Forest. He did not. He's, he's in Idaho. Fires that back across the state line and in. And he does it, and it's just spinning in place inside the bullseye. What a shot. And this for Birdie Barella to a knee outside of the circle. Wow. There we go. Nice shot, Ty. We need to take a moment and reset. Look at where everybody is. Evan Scott still clear by two. Kevin Jones throwing two on 17. <laughs> Smash. Oh my God. Kevin Jones, 89 feet away. Birdie. Alan Blanchard quickly off the tee. Ooh, he goes Heiser flip to turn. Look at this. Still going. Two now over the field with the honors. It's got to keep moving right, but it does stick to about 40. Evan Scott made a putt from about this distance moments ago. Everything is working. He has one more hole to go. He can move potentially to 13 under par. Exquisite. That's the way to finish. That's got to feel good for James. Tap in and secures a position on at least the chase card. Oh! 
Not too shabby for Dallin Blanchard. He hung in there as well. To push the lead to four. Evan Scott by four over Clay Edwards. Barella and Love on the lead card tomorrow. Conrad comes back to secure a chase card position. And look at Nico LaCastro, the hottest of those tied for eighth. Nico will play from the chase card. Yet again, just so much talent looking down this leaderboard, even at a silver event these days. It's just, it's incredible how difficult it truly is to make moves up these leaderboards these days.